Hello guys, welcome back to Hellbound Hackers and uh, we're going to analyze number 29 at the moment, the last available one for the web hacking. Uh, we have a form uh, that say that we are, they are going to use a flat database, so most probably an XML database, because they did not have success with um, MySQL. So, we will need to find the answer. So let's try to figure it out first, how does it work? Test, test, and we got back error, invalid, username or password. Okay, let's go back, let's try to um, take a look at the source code first. Uh, fa let's find some comment, and there is a comment that says, for debugging purpose, uh, put debug true in the URL. So let's copy debug equal true and put it in the index.php that's the first step then let's try to mess up a little bit with the username let's try single quote and single quote again and log in with the debug we are actually able to see how the query are performed and yes this is an XML database and more specifically uh, this is called XPath Okay, we are able to actually inject something because we can see that this this is our input in the username and this is our input in the password. So we can still mess up. How can we do? Uh, at the moment we are only able to see the username and password of inside the database. So if we want to see everything, we should use single quote or one equal one in both of the fields let's go back and put single quote or one equal one in both of the fields as you can see with the bug still on you will get back a list of username and password so expect admin for example as a password this one with the exclamation mark at the end. Let's try to log in and to figure it out if it's actually a username and password. So the username is expat admin right uppercase lowercase uppercase lowercase and the password should be this one. If we log in we actually see that the, it worked so we got back information from username and password but we will need to find the answer instead so let's try to take a look how the query is performed again they are going to extract username and password but we will need to extract everything from the database how can we do this let's have a little bit of space so we are able to inject in this exact point so we will need first of all to close the single quote then the parentheses and then we will need to use the pipe which is include also it's like something and we will need to get instead of slash users or slash user user password we will need to we want everything so we will need to use uh, slash star and then again pipe but at this point we will need to close what we open so we can just try to call something anything you want parenthesis something anything you want equal to something this is used to close to correctly close the query the xml pet so let's copy this sample payload let's go back and put it inside the username and password both at this point we've got more information not only the username and password as you can see we also have what is it user we've got the id we've got the password and finally we've got also the answer you've got successfully injected an expat injection the password is i love expat with the exclamation mark go back and use it in the form in the second form 
Check. Congratulations.